So let's have the solution to example 42. A cable weighing 25 newtons per meter, that's the weight of this cable here, is suspended from point A and passes over the small pulley at B. So this is strictly or supposedly a catenary cable. However, we can use the approximate parabolic, we can approximate this as parabolic cable because the sag to span ratio is small. So when the sag to span ratio is small, then we can treat the cable as parabolic. But the stick definition of this cable, this should be a catenary cable. So tension at B is equal to M times G, B, M times G. And we have a symmetric portion of the cable. So this is the lowest point. So we will call this XA and the other point XB. So XA by symmetry, same elevation, points A and C are of the same elevation. So XA equals X sub C. So XA equals X sub C. Then the equation of the cable is also y equals w x square over 2h, big H, where H is the horizontal component of tension in the cable from parabolic cable. You can we have this uh, formula. So y a is y c is 9 or y a is 9 equals w, which is 25 x a square over 2h. So h is equal to 25 over 18 x sub c square. So let's call this equation 1. Likewise, we have yb which is 9 plus 12 equals 25 x b square over uh, 2h. So h is 25 over 42 of quantity 100 minus x sub c square because xb is 100 minus xa and xa equals x sub c so xb is 100 minus x sub c square. So equating equations 1 and 2 then simplifying we have 7 x sub c square equals 3 quantity 100 minus x sub c square. Let's expand 100 minus x sub c square so 7 x sub c square equals 30,000, this is negative 200 xc times 3, so negative 600 xc, and x sub c square times 3, so 3 x sub c square. So 4 x sub c square plus 600 x sub c minus 30,000 equals 0. Using the quadratic or simplifying x sub c square plus 150 x sub c minus 7500 equals 0. Using the quadratic formula, x sub c equals negative of b plus minus square root of b square, 150 square minus 4 times 1 times negative 7,500 over 2 times 1. So x sub c is 39.56 meters. So from there, we can now compute h or we can compute distance from a to c. 2 times 39.56, so it is 79.12 horizontal distance between A and C. Then for the mass, so tension at B is M times G. So we need the tension at B, which is square root of H square plus uh, vertical component of reaction at B. So this is the horizontal component of tension, so it is 2173. 0.6 newtons. Then V sub B is the vertical component of tension at P is the weight of this cable from the lowest point up to there which is W times XB and XB is 100 minus minus XA or 100 minus X sub C. So 100 minus XA or 100 minus XC times the uniform weight of cable 25 so the vertical component of reaction at B is 1511 newtons. So the tension at B is square root of 
horizontal component of tension square plus vertical component of tension square and we equate it to m times 9.81 so tension at b is 2647.2 newtons equals mass times 9.81 so m can now be computed 269.8 kilograms so that's the solution to this problem